Hey everyone, it's July 14th, and that means that if today's your birthday, you share with Belgian serial killer Marie Alexandrine Becker, known as the Black Widow, who murdered at least 11 victims in the 1930s, and that is her right up there. Becker was born in 1879 and worked on her family's farm as a child, rarely attending school and not receiving much of an education. When she was 16, she moved in with her aunt in Liege, where they brewed their own liquor to keep their customers coming back to her rope shop. She moved on to become a seamstress when she was 21, attracting lots of attention from the men who would frequent the shop where she worked. In 1905, she met Charles Becker and the two got married the next year. She argued frequently with her in-laws, finding an escape from her home life in the arms of other men. Becker carried on a series of affairs, and when her father-in-law died in 1912, she opened a clothing business from their home, copying the styles of famous designers at the time. World War I saw her sewing for the Germans who captured Belgium, and in 1920 she was able to open her own fashion house, employing four seamstresses to manufacture her clothing. In 1932, the now 53-year-old took a 33-year-old lover, but not all was well as her business went bankrupt that year. Her new lover was a known womanizer, and she soon found herself wanting more and more contact from young men. She would attend dance halls and hire gigolos to satiate her increasingly voracious sexual appetite. Her husband died that same year, leaving her an inheritance which she used to pay for the lifestyle to which she and her young lover had become accustomed. The next year, she began sewing for wealthy socialites, but often stole their jewelry to supplement her income. These women frequently turned up dead, as did her young lover in 1934, but not much was thought of it at the time. But when a friend came to her seeking advice about what to do about her husband who had wronged her, Becker suggested she poison the man and gave her some digitalis to use to stop the man's heart. Her friend was disturbed by the suggestion and reported the interaction to the police who began an investigation. They exhumed the bodies of her husband, lover, and clients and found they had been poisoned, arresting Becker in 1936. Her home was searched where they found clothes, jewelry, and handbags that belonged to her victims, along with a bottle of digitalis. The authorities accused her of 11 murders, though many estimates were that she killed more than 20 victims over the past few years. At her trial, she showed no remorse, even laughing at how they had died. She said of one victim, she looked like an angel choked with sauerkraut. Her trial ended with a conviction for seven murders, and Becker was sent to prison for life, dying behind bars during the Second World War. If this is your birthday, I hope you have a great day. Leave me a comment so I can wish you a happy birthday. If you know someone whose birthday it is today, send them this video so they can find out all about their birthday twin. And to Marie Alexandrine Becker, I say, happy birthday, you bastard.